Welcome back to The Grind for another crystal opening. We are going to be opening some six stars with the goal of getting us enough shards so that we can get another seven star. Now, that does depend on me, I believe, getting six dupes from the seven six stars. I'm going to go basic. Um, and then I have to purchase and open some Paragon crystals to hit my uh, goal. So let's just pop this daily quick. Then we're going to jump over. We'll start this off with a quick 10 pop of the side quest calves. See what we can get. Hopefully we can pull a six star uh, to get some, or um, yeah, six star to pull some extra shards uh, just to make it easier on us to, if it'll ever load so that we don't have to get six dupes from those seven six star champions. Um, and we got a couple five stars and another five star and then a first time five star King Groot. Fascinating. Uh, not a bad five star um, amount. So more six star shards at least to start getting us towards that eighth one just in case we fall short. Um, we will figure out how to get there. Um, so I suppose I could pop those open too if I needed to. And I could open some more five stars if I have to. And I can spend some battleground currency if I need to. Uh, again here, let's just grab this. There's one very small chance of something uh, beneficial from there. Probably going to be a three star, so I apologize for the wasted time. Yep. Okay, now we're going to move on to the six star basics. And let's see what we can land uh, there's a ton of champions in the six star basic that I would um, greatly benefit from pulling. Uh, there's a lot of trash in there too. Um, let's start off with six and then go from there. So I would like to pull Hulkling, one of my top ones. Um, I think Iron Doom's in there now too. Uh, there are some awakenings like Immortal Abomination that would be great. Um, Ooh, we are going to land on Valkyrie. Fascinating. That's a first time pull. Um, but she's a very good champion. One of the new champions that I have not acquired yet. But that doesn't give us any extra seven star shards. So that is very fascinating. So we're going to have to purchase this one. Um, so now I'm hoping I don't get Hulkling. Just kidding. I definitely want Hulkling. We will we will get the shards we need eventually. But I'm I'm super hopeful that we can hit it in this video without having to splice things together because that is tedious. Um, so if it ever stops spinning, uh, we'll see. Here we go. If we get our next step towards seven star shards, seriously? Seriously right now? Really? Two brand new skill champions that I've never acquired before. Now, when I want seven star shards, I want to awaken, I want dupes, and I'm getting Two back-to-back -back brand new champions. Really? Fascinating. <laughs> okay. All right. So uh, now number three. Let's give it a try. Uh, Ghost. Hey, hey, first time awakening on Ghost. I was tempted to use a gem on Ghost uh, a while ago and uh, in the not-too-distant past. And now that's the first time awakening and 20 sigs towards. So very good. Very good pull there. I'm very happy about that. Ghost is one of those champions that I'm um, probably, even though I don't use her, um, very much, if at all. Um, I'm probably going to take her up to rank 4, because, and eventually probably rank 5, because I don't see her coming to the 7-star pool uh, <laughs> for a long time, if ever, and she is also SIG-dependent, and so if she did, uh, very much reliant on the SIG, which is unlikely to come. Another first-time awakening of an incredible champion. Fascinating. Wow. This is awesome. Another champion I considered throwing a gem into, um, so potentially of some use for the next abyss type content uh, i would have to rank him up obviously because he is not ranked up yet but fascinating and more seven star shards so um we're on track to be one dupe short and we'll see if we can scrape things together um we are gonna have to purchase the um paragon crystals anyways so we might get some luck out of that okay another first time awakening man we are getting some good luck out of these uh basics so, yes, very happy with that. First time Awakening, he's already ranked 3. So that is uh, quite nice. Very good pull there. Again, more 7-star shards, which is our goal. Um, two more left. Let's see what we can land. I think if we get another new champ from these, we probably aren't going to be able to scrape together enough to get that 7-star that I hoped. Um, so let's see what we do here. I believe that is a first time Awakening as well. 
Let's see. Duplicate champion, awakened ability. Yes. So first time awakening. Lots of first time awakenings here. Very interesting. Uh, the last one of this lot. We might, we might have to scrape together another one, but uh, we'll see here. We'll see what happens. Um, slowing down here. Can we get another dupe and keep us in the running? That is an awakening. I think that is another first time awakening. This is absurd. I. Oh no, he's been awakened already. Okay, so he was he was already awakened one time, but. Uh, okay, crazy. So that is some some really solid champions. Holy. Um, take a couple quick screenshots here. Not bad. I'm very happy with that Valkyrie, actually. I'll have to start um, investing in her. I just started committing into Killmonger, so i um, not sure where that'll put her in the line. But, uh, and then, where are we here? There's those seven-star shards, and we are still a fair bit short. Um, but that is... Not counting the, uh, which I don't think it's this one. I think it's probably this one, the Alliance Milestones. Um, not how to get points. So I'm going to try to snag that one. Not that one. Where are we here? That one. So I need, I think it was six I had to open. Six crystals. That'll still leave us a bit short. So we'll have to figure out what to do with that. But let's go ahead and do six of those. Um, which means I need to purchase four. Let's just grab five, um, and then spin these out. I don't want to spend too much on these crystals, but there are some units available to get back from these, um, milestones, and there are some good rewards for grab. Um, we're going to start off with a four star. Um, at least we're going to be getting some ice out of these. There are some good rewards available in the milestones uh, for spending a small amount, two to 3,000 units. So that's basically what I'm going for. Any six star or seven star is a bonus from these crystals. Um, that's basically how I'm looking at it and how probably you should look at it too. Another five star. So we're working towards another six star. We can always buy some six star shards if we need to. Um, but, you know, we're hoping to land a six star. We're hoping to land a six star. Uh, another four star. And of course, if I could, before I finish with these Paragon Crystals, if I could pull a seven star champion, that would be absolutely insane. I would be extremely happy with that because um, I'm, I'm definitely not expecting a seven star out of these. And you can you can see, you, you never see a seven star even go through this reel. It's absolutely ridiculous. Um, another five star, okay. Um, should we just pop these last three? Because this is uh, probably going to take a, a long time if we uh, keep dilly-dallying here. So let's pop this last three open. See what we can land. If it ever loads. If it ever loads, let's see. Come on now. Give us a nice six star. Give us a nice six star. 8% drop rate. They shouldn't be too far between each other oh my goodness it's just gonna sit there i guess we shouldn't have popped it there we go okay i don't believe that gives us a six star oh a, a brand new six star vision arcus can't be too upset about that he is he has been on my want list and i do need to uh i do need another uh cosmic to rank up so great Good progress here. Good progress. Um, and he's a pain in the butt on defense. And he can be uh, pretty good offensively as well. But it doesn't get us any closer to the seven stars. Let's see if we hit the milestone. So we know. Here we go. Some units back. And the seven star shards. And some more paragon crystals. Okay. And that's going to get us our selector. That is what I was looking for. So I already kind of spent what I wanted to spend. I probably overspent, honestly. Um, but that's okay. That's okay. We're going to open these up. Let's just pop them. We had some good luck with the pop last time. But we have to wait for friggin' days for it to load. Okay. A uh, brand new five star and two four stars. So not not helpful. Not what, we were, not what we were looking for. Okay. Now let's see if there was any solo milestones that I hit on here that are gonna be helpful for us. Okay, some more of those. And one of those, which I'm overflowing on already, so maybe I won't grab it. And then probably wanna end up hitting those units eventually, and then those seven stars eventually. Let's pop these two, see what we land. Come on, baby, let's see something good. 
Let's see another six star. Nope, nothing. Okay, so now let's go see what, what we're at for the seven star shards, where it's the damage that we still have to cover. 250, <laughs> 250. So we just need one more six star awakened. Um, man, we are so close to it. That is just depressing. So we need to get another six star and pray that we land a dupe. How far are we? We're two and a bit thousand away so let's start with this five star nexus that i have here grab that one damn it oh awaken good okay i thought it was the first time because <laughs> i was like i really want toad but um it's a five star so i probably would have passed it up awakening so we've got some more six star shards there and then we got another five star over here, five star crystals. Let's get another awakening there, another dupe. So we get some more shards, good. And then how far are we now? Come on, loading. Um, we are just over 1500 away. So we have, ah, here we go. Come on, Max Zig. Now we are Pretty close, pretty close. Um, let's do a couple basic five stars and then we'll, oh, let's do one basic five star. If it gets us within a thousand, I think I can get the rest from um, the Battleground store. That might be the, the go-to. Are we within a thousand now? That we are. Perfect, oh my goodness, we really, really, Really got to get this, uh, this next six star better be a, a dupe. So Battleground Store, we're purchasing this. To get that thousand, we're going for one more six star basic. Can we make it? Man, this is, this is, uh, crazy. It's down to the wire here. Um, this was more stressful and, um, cutting it close more than I thought it would. And it's a lot longer of a video than I thought it would be. Um, so here we go. What are we going to land? Is it going to be a crazy good first time pull that then is gut wrenching? Okay, first uh, time I it's the second time I pulled him, but I did throw a gem into him, um, so that gives us the shards we need, thankfully, and some extra sig. So I'll have to double check what his next sig point is and maybe toss a few into him. Now the moment of truth, we finally come to that uh, <laughs> stressful but finally achieved fourth six star champion. I mean, seven star champion. I still, I'm having trouble getting that. I Let's do one back out here. Let's go in. My fourth one. This is going to allow me to do more runs through uh, the Shooting Stars quest. And, um, well, that's assuming I don't awaken one of the six stars I already have. Seven stars. Seven stars I already have. Um, which is Hulk, America Chavez, and Domino. It'd be really cool to awaken any of those, but it would also be kind of disappointing that I won't be able to explore more of the quest, uh, and it'll take me longer to get the rest of those rewards. We're slowing down here, and we're landing on Silver Surfer. Fascinating. I never invested in the six star, um, because I'm pretty sure he's still not awakened, or he was just recently awakened. If I do awaken him, um, and he's just leveled up all the way at rank one, that'll be a prestige bump, which is incredible. Um, I do like Silver Surfer, so I think I'll enjoy having him and playing him, but it will be nice to awaken him if I do get there. But not yet, because I need at least five to finish exploring their quest. So that is my fourth seven-star champion. Let's go over and filter out the seven stars just to take a quick look at what I'm dealing with here. Um, I would have loved Bishop, because I still don't have a Bishop as a six-star. Um... But I think that's probably my most wanted. Uh, let's quickly look here. Sasquatch would be cool. Shuri Overseer would be cool, but I already have Overseer ranked up. Yeah, I think, I think, uh, oh, Sunspot maybe. Storm I wouldn't mind either. But I think probably Bishop is my top wanted seven star right now. Um, but we got that Surfer. Very happy with that. We'll rank him up during the level up event, and we're going to jump back into that Shooting Stars quest in the near future to get some more... Um, uh paragon crystals and some more shards so to start working towards the next one so let's see if we've got any more milestones here we've got that one and that one we can claim which we're overflowing on both i have to make some decisions um on what i'm going to do 
next. And then in here, we have the selector, which I think I'm probably gonna go for cosmic because I already have one cosmic and I'm very close to forming another and I don't have any of the others. So we're probably gonna go cosmic on that one and no other rewards yet. I'm hoping we can get to this seven star, but I don't know if that's gonna happen or not. Um, anyways, what a roller coaster. Uh, thank you if you hung out through the whole thing and made it to the end. I think that was a very, um, very successful opening and I hope that your opening goes well. Good luck and I hope to see you in the next video.